though, could turn a misdemeanor into a felony, all because of someone's HIV status, even if the crime has no chance of spreading the virus. And tonight, WCPO 9 News reporter Keith Birigolik digs into a report to see how often those laws are enforced in Hamilton County. At Caracol in Northside, Adam Riley is working to help change the lives of people with HIV. People don't judge you when you have cancer, but people judge you when you have HIV because they have this preconceived notion of who you are. He oversees testing programs in Cincinnati for sexually transmitted diseases, including HIV. You know, I've met a lot of people over the years who have been put in jail for, like, no reason other than their HIV status. Riley says his clients often refuse testing. And you can see it in the data. They think that they may be living with HIV, but they don't want to be charged with a felony for it. Ohio has six laws that penalize people living with HIV, laws that can turn talking to someone about sex into a felony. What we essentially have are antiquated and arcane laws on the books in Ohio. Attorney Kate Mazinski researched criminal cases involving HIV laws in Ohio for more than three years. Wow, I was surprised how often these were enforced. A new study from Equality Ohio and another advocacy group found that there were at least 26 such cases in Hamilton County over six years and 214 throughout Ohio. Hamilton County prosecutors have defended the use of these laws in the Supreme Court before. They argue that they're meant to prevent the transmission of the disease. We reached out to the prosecutor's office this week. In a statement, a spokesman says, changes to the law are matters for the General Assembly. The prosecutor's office will follow whatever revisions to the law are made. In Hamilton County, the Ohio Department of Health says there were just over 3,000 people living with the disease in 2021. We have all of the tools that we need to end the HIV epidemic. But change could be coming. Earlier this year, the Justice Department sued the state of Tennessee after finding its HIV laws violate the Americans with Disabilities Act. The DOJ is now investigating in Ohio. The stigma is the number one issue that's keeping things from changing, and the laws are a real fuel for that stigma. In Hamilton County, Keith Birigolik, WCPO 9 News.